Hello painters, in this video we're going to paint the Pathfinder Deep Cuts two wheel cart. Starting off, we're going to coat the entire thing with some Citadel Known Oil Wash. I like to start on the bottom when doing things like this, just because it's easier to handle get less uh, paint on your hands. Although for this one, you probably want to put on a glove if you have one. As you will see, my hands get quite messy. There I switch to a much bigger brush to speed this up. Just covering the whole thing. All right, we let that dry completely. Next step is some Scale 75 Inktense Wood ink. And we're gonna cover the entire model with this as well. Try not to let it pool up too much, but make sure you cover the entire model. Let this dry completely. As soon as it's dry, I hit it with a spray of uh, matte varnish. I like to use the Model Masters Lusterless Flat. And then we're going to take some Secret Weapon Weathered Wood and dry brush very lightly. Make sure to get almost all of the paint off your brush. I like to use a flat brush when, when I dry brush. And I generally try to go against the grain when I'm doing wood or fur. I wanted this cart to look a little bit weathered but not overly weathered. Now I'm taking some Citadel Seraphim Sepia Wash and I'm just using this to tone down some of the areas where maybe I the, the dry brush got on a little bit thick. So this will kind of blend it back in. Next up, we're going to use our Vallejo Metal Color Magnesium to paint the metal parts. This part that I'm painting right here, I later realized was rope. So I will end up going back over that when I get to the rope section. So do not paint this part with your metal. The axles 
could be left wood or or metal. I decided to go metal just to give it a little more interest. Next up, we've got Reaper Master Series Golden Highlight. We're going to paint all of the ropes. Make sure not to have too much paint on your brush so it doesn't flow onto the wood. Here I've jumped ahead after painting a few more. Next up we've got some Army Painter Soft Tone Wash. We're just going over the ropes to uh, tone them down a little bit. Don't need to worry about getting any of the wash on the rest of the wood because it'll just blend right in. And that's it for this one. Here's the finished product. So, if you like what you saw here, make sure and like this video. If you want to see more, please hit your, the subscribe button. Uh, you can also check out the Devious Dungeons Denizens Facebook page, where you can speak with me directly, ask questions, leave comments. You can also check me out on Devious Dungeons Painting on Twitch TV. There I do live painting tutorials. And you can also check out my Patreon if you'd like to support the channel. Thanks for watching and hope to see you next time.